Hey, it's John with Vision Advisors, and welcome to another Insight with Vision. As we've been talking the last couple of weeks, the month of May is dedicated to Disability Insurance Awareness Month, making people aware of the fact that it's that paycheck that they receive each and every month, whether it's once a month, twice a month, or however often they receive income. That money is necessary to pay for the basic necessities of life. Now, up to this point, we really looked at the underage disability market, but there's an even bigger market than the underage market, and, and that's the market for those that are already retired, the, the, what I call the mature market. And really, disability income for the retirees is addressing the impact of long-term care. For many, many people today, long-term care and retirement is gonna be the singest, single most expensive proposition that they're gonna face in retirement that could really destroy a lifetime of savings. I want to direct your attention to longtermcare.gov. Uh, this is put out by the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services. Some amazing resources that are available on this site to really let you start having that very important client conversation about disability in retirement. And it's something that when we talk disability income to most individuals, they don't think about long-term care as being a disability, but in effect, that's what it is. It, they get to the point from either physical issues or mental issues, incapacity scenarios such as dementia or Alzheimer's, that they can no longer function. And as a result of that, chronic long-term health conditions that require care either at home or at some institutional setting become extremely expensive and it really changes the dynamic of retirement. So as you're having those client conversations during the month of May with your clients, as it relates to disability insurance awareness, don't forget that long-term care insurance is a form of disability income protection because it helps to protect the money that that individual or that family needs in retirement to enjoy life in retirement and to pay those necessary expenses for living in retirement and it can redirect those dollars un unexpectedly to have to go to pay for care. So this is a great time to really start that conversation and really get them thinking about the fact that for a married couple today, 65 years of age, the odds are seven in 10 that at least one of them are going to deal with a long-term care event lasting 90 days or longer, and one in seven of them are gonna be dealing with a long-term care event lasting at least five years in duration. So again, Take a note this month during Disability Insurance Awareness Month to have that very important long-term care conversation with your clients.